video. I have a totally Tiffany grab bag to share with you. Um, they have it on the website mm, like 10 days ago and I noticed I had signed up for alerts and got the notice. They were $50 this round. I got a set of these inserts. I think they might be for the 5x7 fab files. I'm not positive on the size, but I have a couple of the fab files, so I'll have to see if it fits in any of the ones I have. This one's a buddy bag. I'm not sure which one. I'll have to check the size compared to other ones. It could be. No, I don't think it's tall enough to be Edna. I was say it could be Edna. I'll have to check it and see if I can figure out which one it is. I like to label them with what names they are. I got a hot glue gun holder. I have one of these already. I got one in the last grab bag that I got from her, but I'll use it. Um, I ended up using that one for my, um, what did I put on it? My heat wave tool. I got a Laura bag. This is the old style one. Let's see, it was a little used, but that doesn't bother me any. Well, this is the old style one because the new one has the flap that you can put it over a handle of the bag, and it also doesn't have the Velcro dividers like that. So that's the new, the old style one. Um, this is the original Lois bag with the little keychain fob. I have one of these already that I use to hold my um, card making magazines and kits. I'm sure that I can find a use for another one. Might be good for bringing to Expo to shop. I really wanted to get the new style of Lois from the um, HSN Craft Day, but after I ordered the printer, I couldn't afford to buy that. And then I got the Prop Crate apron in purple. I don't have, have the Crop Crate. I do have a um, Office Depot crate, and I have the old style apron in purple. So I can either switch it out for the new style or pick up another crate sometime. Anyways, that's all I got in my bag. Oh, that's all. That was quite a bit. That it was um, way more than fifty fifty dollars worth. I think they said it would be at least a hundred dollars worth, and I think it was even more than that. I should try to add it up and get kind of a rough estimate of what it was. But I think this bag alone is usually thirty. And this is like fifteen. I want to say this is fifteen to twenty, and then the apron I think is like another. That one I'm not really sure on the price at all. And of course the buddy bags are usually seven, eight dollars. So I'm happy with what I got. I I'll put it all to use. <laughs> uh, I was always fun getting grab bags and seeing what's what's inside of them. It's just kind of exciting opening them up and seeing what's there. If so, if you ever see a grab bag and you kind of wonder what's in them, this getting to gives you an idea of Tiffany's. Now each of theirs will will vary because they put in merchandise. Like some of these I could tell had been kind of used and I think what it was she used them like for displays at like expos or HSN or at shows or just in videos to kind of show what they were and then they can't they don't want to sell them that way because they're used so they've been putting them in the grab bags so people can, can have the opportunity to to get a good bargain and still usable items thanks for joining me i'll catch you next time